National Council members underscored their commitment to ensure that legislation serves the best interests of the community, emphasizing their role as diligent lawmakers. We all spoke with one voice and we made amendment. Now, that amendment was very much important because it's going to protect many people. Instead of people resigning at the time or when the result will be announced, now they will only be deemed to resign once they, will, they are sworn in into parliament. So at least the security now for the, the job security is, uh, is secure. The election is going to take place in 27 uh, November. Then the period between there towards uh, March for where they are going to sworn in it will be a very serious concern, either on the point of the we know their salary and so on but then we amend that one that at least it's better for them to resign either on the on the time when they are they are they are, they are occupied the seat in the parliament that will be then in march at the adjournment of the national council today mps express commitment to addressing pressing issues in their constituencies this includes a focus on improving service provision, advancing project development, and bolstering infrastructure across the country. I would like to uh, finalize the issue of the uh, primary health care center that we have put up. Um, there were a few issues outstanding with regards to the electricity to be connected. Uh, our town council promised that they would do it this week. The other is the issue of the uh, uh, police set up, satellite police station that we would like to establish in the constituency. Uh, my office uh, have already um, sourced funds for at least the foundation. Uh, next week I'll be in Marintal at head office uh, to have uh, further negotiations uh, with the um, police commissioner. The drought number one. Priority number one is to choose to eat. People are not dying of malnutrition, the smaller ones. People are not dying of hunger. So we have to go down, push for all this drought relief food to reach the people. Uh, my first priority is that it will bring service close to the people. And also we are focusing more to create projects, to create more job income generation for our youth because we have got, un unemployment is very high. So we want to make sure that in a single budget that we got, at least we take care of our youth. Paulus Mbangu addressed the issue of climate change and drought, categorizing it as a highlight of the session and stressing urgent need to modernize agriculture to reduce natural and climate-related disasters. Martha Mafangio, NBC News, Parliament.